How far can we see in the universe? The further we look into space, the further back we look in time. One of the strangest facts in science is that we can never see anything as it is in the present. We see the brightest star in the sky, Sirius, as it was about eight years ago, the sun as it was about eight minutes ago, and the moon as it was just over a second ago. Even looking at the person next to you, or your own hand, you're seeing them as they were a tiny fraction of a second in the past. That's because light, even traveling as fast as it does, 186,000 miles a second, takes time to reach you. As we look deeper and deeper into space through large telescopes, we're seeing the universe not as it is now, but as it was in the past, closer to its point of origin. The most distant confirmed object to date is a galaxy known as GN Z11. The light we're receiving from it today started on its journey 13.4 billion years ago. The universe itself came into being 13.8 billion years ago, so we're seeing GN Z11 as it was when the universe was only about 400 million years old. The very furthest thing we can see though isn't in the form of galaxies or any other material object, it's the cosmic background radiation that reaches us from all parts of the sky. This comes from a time when the universe was just a few hundred thousand years old. In fact, you can think of it as the much cooled remnant of the Big Bang fireball. But as far as actual objects go, GNZ11 is currently the distance record holder. Now you might suppose that because light's taken 13.5 billion years to travel to us from this galaxy, that GNZ11 is 13.5 billion light years away. But it's a bit more complicated than that, because all the time that the light's been on its way to us, the universe has been expanding. And that doesn't mean that the galaxies have been moving further apart by hurtling through space, it's space itself, or to be more precise, space-time, that's been expanding. And the galaxies have been pulled further apart because they effectively ride on the surface of this expansion. The upshot is that it's a lot further from where we are now to the center of expansion, the Big Bang, and to objects that we can see in the very early universe than 13 billion light years or so. In fact, the most distant things we can see at the dawn of time are more than 40 billion light years away.